Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. On today's video, we're gonna review the Night Owl Wireless 1080p Smart Security NVR system. It's gonna give you eight cameras and a one terabyte hard drive. All right, so now before I continue, don't forget to hit that like button, subscribe, so you can get uh, all latest videos that I post. So now, the wonderful thing about this uh, NVR video recording system is that there's no monthly fees, all right? So there's no monthly fees. He's just basically recording to your uh, hard drive. Anything that uh, gets recorded is stored for more than a month and you can actually change that as you go so now this is a wireless system so all the cameras that you get along with this which we get eight in this one is they're all ac power connected okay so with the cameras you get up to night vision 100 feet of night vision which i already checked on that and it's it looks pretty good in the dark and the other thing is you can also speak through the cameras all right you have two-way audio and your if you have any problems whatsoever you do get a 24 7 support and i can guarantee you that it works because i called last night around 10 30 at night and i got live customer service and that was pretty good so anything else you get obviously smart uh detection so any movement you get an alert and that's pretty good too um what else that's pretty much it i'm gonna go ahead and show you how things look and uh, give you a review of the, the whole system now in the box you're gonna get a couple of cool things here you're gonna get first of all you'll get some little stickers you know warning signs and stuff you can put on your wall i mean the windows or whatever so people can see it and make sure they don't break in <laughs> warning um your thing is obviously the instruction manual you know it's pretty good nice and color explains everything to you um one thing i noticed here the the system works with a application that they have it's called the night owl x for your smartphones android or ios and the other one is the uh night owl x hd or something like that and that one is for your tablets. So if you're gonna use it with your smartphone, make sure you use the Night Owl X app. Okay. Now, all the cameras, I went ahead and I marked them with numbers so I know which one's which. And you'll see it on your on your monitor once you uh, connect your cameras that, that you know which one's which. So you'll set up and it'll be one cameras one through eight. And yeah, that's pretty good. Um, and now I'll show you how to connect your cameras. All right, so on the initial setup, once you connect your hard drive to your TV, um, you're gonna get a, a screen that's gonna look like this. It's gonna have all the camera positions, just like that one through eight, all right? So now when you open up your box, you're gonna get the hard drive system right here. It comes with a little mouse, which is pretty cool as you can see here um has like this extender for wired uh, wireless connection so it can pick up the the signal for all the other cameras all right you're gonna have obviously your connector the power um you connect it directly to your router all right so it gives you a nice quick connection um and you have your antennas here in the back you got two here all right so now I'm gonna show you how you set up. So word of advice, um, when you're trying to connect your cameras, you're gonna basically um, have to come to the setup, initial setup here. Let me go here. It has a main menu. Your password, your username is always gonna be admin. I think, I'm not sure if you can change it, but it says you can, but I haven't done it yet. Now, let me go ahead and log in and show you what to do. Hold on. All right, so now I'm in. So now, when you're gonna get to log into your cameras, you're gonna do the initial setup. You're gonna connect to the uh, network. You're gonna connect 
it's going to show you different readings as far as like how long you want to store your memory of the cameras and your hard drive um different things here all right so when you want to add your cameras you're going to come to where it says camera and then see i already have my cameras set up this took a little is this was a little process okay just to let you know um so you're basically going to go to where it says add camera add camera right there and then you're going to connect your cameras all right so when you get your camera you have your antenna you go ahead and you screw it in it's very simple screw it in right there okay i went ahead and labeled them in the back so when I know I'm connecting the camera. I can see which one it connected to the to the system. All right. So now you go ahead and connect it. And once you connect the power, you're gonna get a little green light. It's gonna start flashing green. All right. The camera should give you some light like that. It should start blinking back and forth. Now, since I already did the initial setup on this, I should just be able to connect already to the camera. But since this is your first time, like I showed you, you go to the add camera section and then you connect your camera. Once you have it ready, connected, it's this white button right here on the, on the switch right here. You're going to press and you're going to hold it. When you hold it for, I don't know, it's like 10 seconds or so, you're going to get a sound on the camera or a voice that will tell you, okay, your camera's ready to connect. Or it goes, almost like that. All right. So now, once you connect it, your reading on the system will tell you camera one, camera two, pairing, connecting, and this and that. So now, let me show you how it looks on the computer, on the system. So now, as you can see, camera's working. And I know you see little, some little lines going through there. But that's because I still have the plastic on the lens. So it is pretty clear. It looks nice. That's the night vision, as you're seeing. And now, if you wait a minute or two, it'll connect and show you the regular color. All right, guys. So I tried to get it to show you the the actual color. Um, it's pretty nice colors, actually. But I guess because of the time or whatever, it's not it's not giving it to me right now. Uh, it was on and then it went off. But anyway, so as to conclude this, um, pretty happy with the system. It records nice, good audio, good video, and uh, a lot of time of like I said, one terabyte of memory, which is really great. So if you like this video, please don't forget to subscribe, give that, hit that like button, and share this with your friends. Thank you, and hope to see you again.